I'm committed to this. We're going to get this done, okay? I will retry. We have to give him low red cards, okay? Easy mode. Then we have to give you another low red card. Let's do this. Seven is as low as it gets there, I think, yeah? Crime is too much work. Yeah, can't we just get good at cards? We're gonna shuffle in jog, okay? And then... If, if this whole thing doesn't matter because I took a seven instead of a three, I'm gonna cry. I'm not gonna get angry, I'm just gonna cry, okay? Because three, four, two, three, four, five might be the minimum to count as a low card. Okay, we drop six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. We shuffle, we out jog it to the left, we in jog to the right. We shuffle, we shuffle it down to the top. It's at the top. We drop a card for each player that isn't our target. Then we shuffle it. Then we drop and offset. One, one, one. Then we in jog to the right. Then we shuffle it down. Then we do a false cut. Or we, we after they cut, we engage in misdirection to fix the cut. He's actually done it. I must say, I'm impressed. I got it. It's only like 20 steps. I'm ready, dude. You know what? Maybe we'll just do a one more. You should practice it till it's second nature, okay? Why don't you take a six? I'm not I'm not a hundred percent confident. I think we should try again. Okay, and then you know what? Why don't you take another six right there? That's that should be fine. The two would be better, but it doesn't matter. Okay. There's also another one after this. Come on, man. You gotta shuffle and in jog. Then you tap six times. Five, six. Then you out jog, shuffle down. Out jog left, shuffle down. Shuffle me to the top, please. Thank you. Now we tap three times. And we shuffle. Then we tap. And then we tap till we're offset. Then we in jog right. We shuffle it down. Then we neutralize our opponent's cut. Cheers to you. We did it. I'm ready. <laughs> we can't stop yet, and why is that? You said the lad might need to stack cards for two different targets. Half an A press? Before we discuss the 28th technique, we must introduce to you the concept of parallel universes. And I never will, Compta. Eugene is a natural, always improvising to get the two of you out of trouble. Have faith in him. Very well. I trust you, lad. You'll have plenty of techniques to keep you occupied tomorrow, Eugene. And providing you stick to my plan, there will be lots of drama to witness, too. Try to get some rest, lad, if you can amongst all this debris. No practice? I don't need it! We, we, we just practiced twice. We in the damn walls. You, what new mystification is this? You were dead. I cheated death. Guards, arrest these men. You will not. William, what is happening? Your Majesty, I am the Comte de Saint-Germain. Of course, Comte, what a pleasure to see you again. That was an opportunity to practice how you're going to improvise. My brother in Christ, how can you practice improvisation? That doesn't even make any sense. It's like uh, practicing how to be spontaneous. And you are, madame. 
Baroness de Beauregard, your majesty. Yeah, and this is the comp sung young Eugene. With pleasure. Brilliant. I've looked forward all day. Yeah, of course, improv class is a scam. Just, like, be funny. I think yes and is a stupid rule. I think there's, especially knowing that the form of improv is that you're always supposed to yes and, saying, fuck you, I'll never do that, might be the trump card you gotta pull in some improv type situations. Oh, my name is uh, Princess Hollenhauser of Zurich. Fuck you, no it isn't. Your name's Sheila, and you're my wife, and we live in the Australian Outback. That would be a sketch. Now that's a sketch right there. Okay, hold on. Uh, McGregor, sit down and join us, please. What an exciting game, your majesty. One for the history books. The sovereign of France fighting against the red lion, the alchemist, and the young cub. The sovereign of France fighting against the red lion, the alchemist, and the young cub. The red lion? Who's that? What, McGregor didn't tell you? Pray tell, madame. During the unrest in Scotland, the English had an unusual asset in the person of William McGregor, also called the Red Lion, a strong officer wearing the red coat of the English forces. High red cards for McGregor. I can do this. Yeah, let's start small. He's pretty loaded, though. High red card for McGregor. This is the easy, the easy mode. Doesn't get much higher than that. Take your time. Take your time. I'm decompressing. I'm preparing myself. We're gonna... I forgot immediately. I blanked. We're gonna shuffle in and jog. Then we're gonna tap one, two, three, four, five, six. Then we're gonna out jog. Then we're gonna shuffle it down. Then we're going to shuffle it to the top. Then we're going to tap one, two, three. Then we're going to shuffle. Then we're going to tap, 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 tap. Then we're going to in-jog to the right. Then we're going to shuffle it down. Then we're going to neutralize the cut. Cheers, boys. Well done. William, it seems the Red Lion just killed his own king. Your Majesty, I wouldn't. We made McGregor win, which makes him look sussy. Yes! Well done, Eugene. You couldn't take on the Red Lion and his treacherous red cards, but you played very well. Indeed, Comp, your protege is a very quiet yet brilliant player. Eugene is mute, Your Majesty. He has no tongue. No tongue? Majesty, don't listen to- Enough! Could it be? You? Only you, the King of Kings, could answer that question, Your Majesty. We shall play. Okay, so I gotta give the King some Kings. Drop him one of these real quick. Perfection. Perfection. The perfect smoky eye. One, two, Kings that will adore you. That's what I said now. We're gonna shuffle and in jog. We're gonna one, two, three, four, five, six. We're gonna out jog. We're gonna shuffle it down. We're gonna shuffle it up to the top. We're gonna shuffle. It's at the top. We're gonna tap. One, two, three. Then we're gonna shuffle it. Then we're gonna tap. One, two, three. And then we're gonna in jog. And then we're going to shuffle it down. Enjoy not being sus. It's just my idiosyncratic shuffling technique. <laughs> Nothing sus about that. He's not going to be sus. He won. You're never going to be sus if you're winning. That night, 20 years ago, I lost Sophie. I lost everything I loved. I never thought I'd see my son again. But are you my son, Eugene? Could it really be you? This is a trap, my king. Don't listen to these people. They're just cheats. Look at young Eugene and tell me that's the face of a cheat. He merely blushes in the presence of high nobility. We want kings, queen, red kings, queens, or jacks. 
To appease Mr. McGregor, let me shuffle. Then we will ask the Baroness to cut before letting Eugene deal the cards. How exciting. I've never cut a deck before. Really? It's pretty easy. It's trash. I want it. Palm that shit. I want them. I you you can't take this. I need a shark deal. I think I did it. I think I did it. Oh! He <laughs> didn't say well done, though. A masterful victory. So, William, did you see any foolery? No, sir, but that doesn't mean he didn't cheat. Stop behaving like a popinjay and sit down this instant. Now, dear William, are you done insulting us with your blunt antics and feeble accusations? How would I know? I'm not the one wiggling an arrogant tongue in an empty head. The Comte de Saint-Germain is a scoundrel trying to trick you, my king. Messieurs, voyons, messieurs, please, the violence of these words. I don't know what to think. You should play one last round. Let's see if our dear alchemist wit is truly as sharp as an ace of spades. <laughs> I've got to give Comte an ace of spades. And I've got to give McGregor the lowest card in the game. I gotta just give him a low card or lowest card. How am I gonna? This is the hard part, okay? Give him, a, give him a two. So we want to see an ace of spades or a two. All I have is a two. You may have the two. Then we need the Ace of Spades first. Are they sitting next to one another? I gotta... Dude, look how sussy he is. I can't do this. Are you crazy? Shuffle in jog. One, two, three, four, five, six. Out jog me. Shuffle me. Shuffle me. Ooh, shuffle me. Tap one, two, three, shuffle me, shuffle me, maybe it's in God's hands now. Thank you, I think we're done here. But your majesty, we have important things to tell me. <laughs> you almost had me there. Guards arrest these people and you're going to send me to... Oh my god. And my ass got killed? Are you sitting comfortably? I'm glad you feel at home. Do you want to get back to your life? Yes. Yes, please. I can send you back. Are you ready? I'm going to cheat death. I'm going to cheat death. In jog me. I'm insane. I'm the best to ever do it. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm definitely dead. A win for me. I'm allowed to take your soul, but I will not do that. Thank you. I appreciate that.
Son, you had us worried for a second there. <sighs> How are you, Eugene? I'm fine. Okay. I don't need the shark deal, okay? Skip that. Do you remember my plan? The Erdenaz special. You steal two cards and deal them to specific targets. I'm going to need to rehearse this one. Okay. This one's easy. <laughs> Erdenaz needs low cards. This is easy. Low red cards. Anything else today? I was planning on it. I didn't expect the rest of the uh, game would be this difficult. But this, you got to knock this out today. You're never coming. I, if I leave this for two days and then come back with weekend brain, there's no shot that I'm ever going to beat this. I know we tap six times. Then we're out jogging to the left. We shuffle it down to the top. We tap three times. We shuffle again. We tap once, twice, three times, four times. We in jog. I out jogged. We shuffle once. We tap one, two, three, four, five, six. We out jog, we shuffle until it gets to the top. We tap one, two, three, shuffle again, tap, 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 in jog, shuffle me down, and then botch the cut. Dude, this is. I am not against difficult games. The This might be a little too much. Okay, would you like to practice some more? No. Okay, now, two targets. Let's practice that. How to get cards to two targets. What would, okay, so we have to give a five to one and the seven to another. So we need to get them separated by one. Shuffle me and in jog or out jog. No, that's an in jog. There's no tap required here. What if we just tap seven times? One, two, three, four, five, six. No, okay. So it's the same. Then roll me. I mean, to shuffle me. All the way to the top. Then, tap three. <laughs> tap me. Tap me. <laughs> Shuffle me. Tap me. And then tap me till they're on the right units. This is right, right? In jog me. Shuffle me down. Oh, you're done? Are you ready to move on? No. <laughs> okay. Absolutely not. So it's the same to start with. Shuffle and in jog. Then one, two, three, four, five, six. Then you're going to out jog. Then you're going to shuffle all the way down till it's at the damn top. More. Then you're going to tap one. Two, three, four, five. Shuffle. You tap one less. One less. No, you tap two more. <laughs> then you shuffle. Then you tap it, and then you tap till they're offset properly. 
and then you in jog to the right. It's it's actually double switch. It really is. Yes, okay. Very well. Try to get some rest. <sighs> I don't know what we have to get him. <laughs> I think we gotta give him a red, a high red card. This should be fine. I'm very fast at reading. Don't skip the dialogue. Okay, just get it right the first time. Shuffle in jog. One, two, three, four, five, six. Out jog me to the left. Shuffle me down. Be anti-sus here. Con continue to shuffle. Okay, now. One, two, three. Shuffle me down. Tap me, one, two, three, four, to the right, shuffle me down, fake cut the deck. Cheers. William, it seems the red lion just killed his own king. Well done, Eugene. Wait. Wait for it. No tongue. Don't listen enough. Could it be you? Only the king of kings could answer that question, your majesty. Okay, the king needs two kings, of course. Here's one for you. Two kings. Shuffle. One, two, three, focus. Four, five, six. Out jog to the left. Shuffle it down. Fast. One. That's good enough. Tap three times on the ceiling if you want me. Shuffle down. Tap. Two, three this time. In jog to the right. Shuffle it down. Get ready for the cut. No problem. Now, the next part is the hard part. <laughs> okay, yeah, 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 okay. Eugene needs red nobility. This is not even the hard one. We want to steal that. What? I didn't, I didn't glance. I probably just lost. Okay, deal me, deal me, shark me, deal 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 me. The end of this game could have been handled a little bit better, I think. Why well, I don't even have to, you don't, I'm just gonna pay you, who cares? It's hard, man. I'm not saying I don't suck, I'm just saying the barrier for success is so high. Like, you have to get like a 
Actually, I think you need to get 100% on the test in order to pass. In real life, the only test you need 100% in order to pass is your fishing license. This shit is like automatic. The harder something is, the more they tend to lower the requirement of your performance in order to actually certify you. Because they get that it's difficult. Okay, I want this card. I'm going to sticky hand it. And then we need to tap it, tap it, in jog it, in jog it, shuffle it, shuffle it, shuffle it, shuffle it, shuffle it down. Oh, she's sussy, dude. That's it. We're done. Then we deal this shit and I win. Ha, I lost. But you will be back soon enough. People are like, this isn't difficult. Bro, show me the state of your life. My life is in a great place. This game is in disarray. So your life must be an incredible in an incredible spot if this shit looks automatic to you. I'm ready. I skip. I skip. It's harder than Dark Souls. In Dark Souls, you literally just press the circle button. Okay. This is... Kings for McGregor. Easy mode. It doesn't have to be Kings. It has to be just red, right? Yeah, just red. Strong red. Shuffle, end in jog. Tap, one, two, focus, three, four, five, six. It out jog to the left. Shuffle it down. Do it fast. Faster. Reset me. Shuffle and in jog. Reset me. One, two, three, four, five, six. Out jog me. Shuffle me. Shuffle me. Shuffle me. Shuffle me. Tap one, two, three. Shuffle me. Tap one, two, three. Four. Out jog, in jog me to the right. Shuffle me. Little misdirection. Dude, the perfect took a little sus off too. Let's go. That was necessary, I think. We need to give two kings to the king. I'm ready. Two kings to the king. Take a deep breath and focus yourself. What are we going to do? We're going to shuffle in and jog. We're going to tap one, two, three. Four, five, six. We're going to out jog to the left. We're going to shuffle until it gets to the top. One. That's good enough. We're going to tap one, two, three. We're going to shuffle. Then we're going to tap one, two, three. And then we're going to stop it right there with an in jog to the right. We're going to shuffle it down. And here comes the cut. Give me some perfection, please. We needed a little non-sus there. I'll take that. We got some room to play with. Eugene needs red nobility. Now we sneak a peek.
Oh, shit. <laughs> Hopefully that's just some sus. Okay, you need a fake deal. Fake deal, deal, fake deal, fake deal, shark me, send it. Saved. <clears throat> Take a deep breath. <laughs> Stop behaving like a pop and jay and sit down this instant. Now the now the hard part. Keep your head clean. Messieurs. You should play one last round. Let's see if Compte is as sharp as an ace of spade. Compte, ace of spade, McGregor, any two. Compte, ace of spade, McGregor, any two. You take this two. Don't screw this one up. The sus meter is quite high. The ace of spades. Shuffle me. I'm not glancing. Shuffle me and in jog. One, two, three, four, five, six. Take me to the left. Shuffle me. Shuffle me. Shuffle me to the top. One, two, three, four, five. Shuffle me. Tap me. Tap me. Jog to the right, shuffle me. Take a deep breath. Have we done it? <laughs> Monsieur McGregor, your game is so poor, so narrow. It's like watching a rat trying very hard to play like a cat. Comte, you are a cheat and a con, man. And you are a ghoul, a monster unmoved by the depth of his own corruption. A disease indifferent to the smell of corpses it leaves behind. Holy cow. I protect the monarchy. When vultures like you, this mute, or Sophie Dobigny threaten the throne, I must, crush, I must crush them. I poison them. I hang them. I dispel them. Both of you will die. Guards? He is Madge. Arrest this man. Thank you, your majesty. Is Arrest McGregor? I broke up with my ex-girl. Here's her number. Psych! That's the wrong number! Serial, serial, serial. Your Majesty? No, you will not say another word. Neither will you, Baroness. Or should I say, Ardnas? You can remove the wig. I am still no gentleman, Your Grace. Indeed, you've always been a thief of dubious gender. Okay. But at least I know now that you're not to blame for Sophie's death. That said, the cruelty of McGregor's revelation doesn't shed that much light on your own game. Follow me, Eugene. I want to talk to you in private. You two are forbidden to leave. Wait here. We have one last game to play. Dude, what if the final technique is just playing cards normally? Maybe that's the true... Enlightenment is just enjoying a game. I wanted to ask you a single question. So think carefully before answering. Are you my son? No. My son is dead, isn't he? Thank you for your honesty. It might be late, but I appreciate it. Do you have questions of your own about anyone? I'm listening. Not really. You? I don't know about you. Anything else? No more questions. Fine, bring them both in. <laughs> oh, you mean me? Okay. Hey guys, the king's ready for you. Listen, son, for what it's worth, I am sorry. I am as angry as you. We've been played for fools all along. Look at the smug face on our dear Baroness. Sire the lore. Hey, I gotta give you a reason to play it yourself. 
You do know that the final act was not part of my plan. I'm on your side, so why don't you tell me what you just spoke to the king about? Follow me. I'm not moving a muscle until Comte leaves too. He's not to be trusted. I saw you just spoke with Ernest. I wouldn't lis listen, listen to a word they say. Follow me. Why? What does the king want from us? Before I go, allow me to hand you an olive branch. I want, you, I want to show you a strategy that will grant you full agency in this next game. Begin with the bottom drag. For this strategy, it is crucial that you find four aces. Anything lower will be too weak? Anything lower will be too weak? Move the aces to the bottom of the deck. That's an automatic play, I remember that. I have a deck here if you'd like to practice. Okay. This doesn't seem hard, at least. They're heavy. They're heavy today. There's one. There's two. As long as you let me set the deck up, we got no problems here. It's not sus at all. Yoink. This is mega sus. No, you don't understand. I'm telling like an awesome story or like I wait till there's like a lightning bolt or something in the background. Would you like to try that again? That won't be necessary. Follow up bottom drag with a false riffle. You can have a quick practice. Yes, this is a good idea. Nailed it. <laughs> I would like to try it again. So we can... Yeah, as long as the four aces go down first, that's okay. That puts it on the bottom. Move on. All right. Now all that's left is for us to go over the progression of the palm glimpse. Monsieur Le Comte, the king wishes to speak to you. Ah, listen, a final word. I have a feeling I will not leave Versailles a free man, but if you're given the chance to escape, I beg you, take it. Go back to Pau, live a simple life. I care about you. Bank, bank, bank. Just give four aces, forehead. Leaving you with an unfinished strategy. At best, your mentor is incompetent. It wouldn't be the first time he betrayed you. It's just as well. I'm here to help you. Don't worry, I ran out of plans. Besides, the last part of our game is yours to decide. I recommend you make use of the palm glimpse progression to steal your stack from the bottom of the deck before sneaking it back after the cut. Here, take this deck. Show me how you'd palm the aces. Okay. We know this is one. Then just do it again. Nice. That's it. Oh, I palmed all four there. Okay, move on. Very well. Now with your stack safely on the bottom, it's time to use shark deal. That's where you deal from the top to your opponents and take yours to the bottom. Okay. No doubt he kept you on a short reign you never considered wielding such control. Why don't you give it a go? Easy mode, man. Ready for this? Take one of these, one of these, one of these. This one's for daddy. One of these, one of these, one of these. This one's for daddy. One of these, one of these, one of these. This one's for daddy. One of these, one of these, one of these. This one's for daddy. And then, you know what? I'm going to shark deal myself anyway, the last one, just for fun. A win for young Eugene. Beware of the quiet ones indeed. Another round? That won't be necessary. Are you done making faces? Hundred percent I'm giving myself the aces, no doubt. You say Mara, you Mara Vaga you. The king requests both of your company. I believe in you, boy. I trust your judgment. The expert dealer. Number 28. The actual ending. Give me the victory in the last round and I will do the rest. I give myself the victory in the last round and I will race you to the door.
Sit me, please. Frankly, I don't know what to do with you. I could easily send you to Guyana in chains or give you lands and a title. Your grace, I didn't finish. Your majesty, listen. I'm sure each of you is eager to plead his cause. Eugene, please take the deck. Let's play one last round. Only the winner will be able to grace me with his advice on what I should do next. You know what? I actually trust the count on this one. Believe it or not, I think we let the count give advice. I can't give advice as I am mute, which means the king would have to default to his own advice, which I do not care to experience. I made a mistake there. I thought I had overstepped one, but it's actually just because I had marked it earlier. Bro, my aces. So I think the way that we do best for ourselves is we give the count one last chance to betray us, but I don't think he will. I don't think he will. He absolutely will. I trust him, man. Perfect gameplay so far. Trust the king. We steal these. I trust him. He literally told you to look out for number one. Oh, yeah. I'm still giving him the aces, man. What if I just gave everybody an honest stack of cards? Or I gave them all one ace each? Whoa! No, Eugene, I can withstand your accusations. I understand your anger. But I cannot bear a sloppy cheat. I have spent an hour and 41 minutes teaching you card tricks. We've been wandering through the whole bloody country. We're in Versailles playing against the King of France. Who is, if you'll excuse me, your majesty, a tedious player. Pardon me, but I'm not finished. I'm so very disappointed in you, Eugene. How could you manage to misplace an ace here of all places? Got him. What did the Comte expect with this little rant? I do not know. The king asked for our heads right away. Fortunately, we were only sent to the Bastille. I never heard of the Comte again. Erdenas disappeared in his usual manner. I was forgotten for a while. Then suddenly I became a hero of the people. Why? I do not know. I was released. I left for Poe and took over Miss Porterhouse's tavern. And here I am, writing these lines. It's the 12th of August, 1789, and the old world is over. I think I got, like, the worst ending I conceivably could have. It ended with, like, a joke, and then, like, happily ever after. <laughs> there was no pageantry at all. Wine, Eugene, we need more wine. Yes, more wine. I, your lord, forgive me, but I'm about to go back to the old me. Eugene Le Powa, isn't it? I'm Citoyen Martin. The Parliament sent me here to tell you that you're a patriot. It's not a word I use lightly. The funds you gave to our Cascarol friends helped the revolution immensely. I knew I was playing the long game. My man's got two spades. He sticky palmed it. You think I didn't see your sticky palm? I'm sussing him. You're absolutely right. Yoink. Oh, four, four ace of spiders. But how? What is wrong with you? Still got it. The end. No disrespect to the credits, of course. Dude, Card Shark, that was a cool game. I'm gonna be honest. I think at the end of it, they're asking more than the average person is going to be willing to give. I'm insanely compliant. I'm unbelievably good at following instructions. I don't know that the average gamer is going to be capable of, uh, of getting through that final couple of boss fights. 
So here's what I'm saying. I guess I'm putting the chip on your shoulder. I'm saying only buy this game if you're a genius. Only geniuses can play this game. You won't last 30 seconds playing this game. Try not to come challenge. Slash marker card shark.